Hey guys, this is Rich Light and Gadget, and what we have here is the Lenovo LePad K2010. And as you might have heard before, this is a tablet running on Tegra 3, and it's powered by Android Ice Cream Sandwich. And you might not be able to see here, but the resolution here is actually uh, I mean, very impressive. It's 1920 by 1200, so very sharp indeed, and you definitely need something like Tegra 3, which is a quad-core chip, to uh, run this thing. Uh, as you can see, the UI hasn't been optimized just yet, but this is a prototype, um, and there's, they haven't finalized the availability yet. Uh, but we, as far as we know, this will be launched in China first, then followed by an international launch. So, as we've mentioned previously, you can see there's a fingerprint scanner on the back, which can also act as a mouse. Um, we're not quite sure when would you, you would use this, but uh, the, the option is out there for you. And the back here is, has a sort of false metallic feel. Um, so, and there's a camera on the back as well with LED flash. Um, you can see the volume rocker here with a sort of mini SIM slot. And there's a rotation lock here. On the top here we have a power button with an SD card slot and on here we have the 3.5mm headphone jack with a USB port. So, oh, and finally at the bottom we have an HDMI mini yeah, port with a modified micro USB port which also provides um, audio and data input so that and Lenovo will be providing a special adapter for this but it will also work with the standard micro USB port for uh, power uh, re for recharging so so far so good uh, feels really solid obviously it's slightly heavier and thicker than the S2 series tablet we saw just now but this is aimed for the um, s small business users oh no doubt cost a bit more but this is a very powerful device and we're very much looking forward to its launch later this year